Hi and hello everybody. Welcome to my channel Madras Tech Talks. Let's talk tech. Thanks for dropping by to see my first video on YouTube. My name is Sunil and I'm a tech lover. Now let's dive into today's video. iQoo has released the 10 and the 10 Pro phones enabling the fastest ever charging speeds of 200 watts on any smartphone in the market today. With a 4700 mAh battery, which is split into two cells, the phone is advertised to be capable of charging up to 100% in 10 minutes with fast wireless charging speeds of up to 50 watts, reverse wireless charging of 10 watts, and with support for PPS, I think this phone is rock solid in the power department. Unlike most smartphone manufacturers today, iQoo has decided to add a charger in its box with a 5 feet USB-C charging cable. Now that's commendable considering the present trend in the industry. A perfect sequel to the iQoo 9 Pro, this phone comes with the latest Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 chipset, which provides a boost of up to 10% in performance. Both iQoo 10 and 10 Pro would be running the latest Android 12 with Origin OS and the phone would come with 8 and 12 GB LPDDR5 RAM configurations. There would be two storage variants that would be offered, the 256 GB and the 512 GB. The phone would feature a 6.78 inch E5 AMOLED panel with 1440 by 3200 pixels resolution. This is a LTPO 3.0 panel and therefore it supports a variable refresh rate up to 120 Hz. Gamers, this phone is going to be backed with a Vivo V1 Plus chip which uses the interpolation to increase frame rates for games and therefore keeps the device temperatures under control. That's just not it. The V1 Plus chip has to play another role to help process the images shot from the 50 megapixels GN5 sensor. With a f1.88 lens and gimbal stabilization, the phone can shoot 8K videos at up to 30 frames per second. With the triple camera system, the second camera is a 3x 69mm telephoto camera with optical image stabilization and with a 14.6 megapixel sensor. The third camera on the back is a 150 degree ultra wide angle lens with a 50 megapixel sensor. The front selfie punch hole camera is located at the center with a 16 megapixel sensor. As regards connectivity, the phone features a dual SIM, supports 5G, has Wi-Fi 6, Bluetooth 5.3, NFC, amongst other industry standards. With regards to security, the phone features a crazy fast and large ultrasonic fingerprint reader. It takes less than 0.2 seconds to unlock the phone. Now that's some real speed. The 10 and the 10 Pro are going to be available in China from the next week and they would be available in two colors, the black and the white. The white phone would be coming with the BMW M branding. This phone is expected to hit the Indian markets by the end of September 2022 and is likely to be priced at around 60,000 rupees and with the top end going all the way up to 70,000 rupees. The vanilla model, the iQ10, was also released alongside and the charger speeds are up to 120 watts. This phone, however, does not support wireless charging and the ultra-wide camera also has a 120 degree field of view with a 30 megapixel sensor. Though the screen size is the same, this screen has a much lower resolution of 1080 by 2400 pixels and most importantly is not an LTPO panel. This phone is likely to be priced at around 45,000 rupees for the base model and may cost up to 55,000 for the top end. That's it from me for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please feel free to hit the subscribe button and smash the like button. See you soon in another tech video. Bye-bye.